So this is a bit of a top tip here. So when you have your fascias then redone, make sure they have the tile overhang correct. It's got to be at least 50 mil. So just come and have a look at this over here, guys. So this is a great example. Somebody's put plastic fascia onto the wooden fascia here. They haven't then looked and thought about it or they don't know really what they're doing because these eaves tiles aren't even overhanging, are they? I mean, is this, this something that you've ever seen before, Will? Not for a while, Tone, but it's not very <laughs> ideal, as you can see, mate. Yeah, it's definitely, uh, you can see all this line here. And as it comes further down, if you look here, it goes in even further. Any rain that gets through is going to come into the back of this fascia. It's going to bleed in. It's going to rot out the back of your rafters, which is what you don't want. You can actually see, and then later on down the line, they must have had an issue internally because of obviously some has then come along and put this plastic stuff in here that's no good. So if you take them off, we'll look. You can actually see it's rotted out all of this, look. Always be very aware when you renew fascias, whoever's gonna do it for you, make sure you get that 50 mil overlap that should be there because that 50 mil from fascia line here is so important. And then you can actually see then there, there's the, some of the wasp nests. We've already taken two out on the other side because we had the wipeout wasp guy come, didn't we, to eliminate the wasp. We had two or three here. But this is a great example of fascias when people renew their fascias. Always make sure you take off the back fascia or make sure your tile hang is enough so you don't have this issue here guys, okay? Mm -hmm.